Chief Minister Digambar Kamath on Wednesday assured a mechanism to regulate the entry of Goans into the casinos. The assurance of the Chief Minister came after the delegation of the casino employees met him after holding a protest rally in the capital city. The rally was staged to highlight their opposition to the government's decision to increase the casino entry fee. It may be recalled that the government had increased the casino entry fee from Rs 200 to 2000 with the intended purpose of discouraging Goans from entering the casinos. However, it was opposed by the casinos. The Chief Minister on Wednesday assured the casino employees that the government would surely come out with a solution. The Chief Minister said two options were under consideration, either to reduce the entry fee or to make the production of IT return proof mandatory by Goans to discourage Goan youth from visiting the casinos, informed casino employee Gaurav Kulkarni, who represented the casino employees. There are certain people having certain amount of net worth who local net local people who will be having net worth who will be coming into the casinos. Only those people will be allowed to come in the casinos. For example, if I as an I working anywhere else, I'm having a net worth of maybe I'm paying an annual tax of 25 to 30,000 rupees annual tax and income tax. I will be pro providing my tax documentation to the government. The government will, give, will be giving me an ID card where I can go ahead, through which I can go ahead and enter the casino anywhere in Goa as a local. For the tourists, there is absolutely no barring to enter the casinos. Yes, they will be forming income. a mechanism through which these papers have to be given for a local person to enter the casino. There are around 18 casinos operating in the state. Mr. Kulkarni stated that more than 90% of the 4,000 casino employees are going and if the casino business was closed, it would result in the unemployment of thousands of people. Both options are there. So that depends. It is we who need to go ahead and work out things for the government and for this thing. Because there is a lot of Goan youth who is working out over here. Especially we Goans, we are working, our livelihood is on this. We need to go ahead and survive for this. Earlier in the morning, around 3,000 casino employees gathered at Azad Mardan in Panjim and held a protest rally in the city. Sabina Martins, one of the leading opponents of casinos in the state, while speaking to Goa 365, said that 2,000 rupees was a small sum to stop entry of Goans into the casinos. It should be at least 5,000 rupees, she said. The 2,000 fee, I, many people feel it is still too less. It should be at least uh, 5,000. But we are of the opinion that we do not want casinos. Today the casinos have uh, closed down, saying that it is going to kill casinos. We would like them to close every single day so that they don't kill our families.